everybody got a deuce. What? Hi friends, my name is Chandu. Now in this video, I am going to show you how to design an inverting amplifier using multi-sim. Now I will show you the circuit diagram of the OP amplifier first. This is the circuit diagram of the OP amplifier. Here we are using the pins 2, 3, 4, 7 and 6. For inverting, we have to connect the voltage source at the inverting number 2 pin. And for non-inverting, we will give normally. And the power at 4 negative voltage and the at 7 positive voltage here positive vs and negative vs here plus v and minus v for minus symbol it is inverting and the output is taken at a sixth pin v out and this is the diagram of the ic if we connect to the positive it is non inverting and if we connect to the neg negative it is inverting negative is second pin and uh, positive is third pin I will, now I will show you the inverting amplifier with negative feedback using multi-sim. First open multi-sim. Launch. Here it opens, it takes some time to load. Yes, it is the sheet multi sim. Right click here and uh, select place components. Here select all groups. Here it is arranged in alphabetical order. Go upside and select OP amplifier. It is in the list in alphabetical order. Here you can see that OP amp. Here select the IC number 741 and click OK. Place it on the board. And close it. This is the IC number 741. Here you can see that the board is here you can see that it is third pin and second pin is inverting third pin positive sixth pin is output and first pin and fifth pin we left it offset and this is seventh one and this is fourth pin it is the sound for one ic now you have seen the diagram here we take the output here this is the feedback resistance rf and here is the uh, input resistance r in and here is the input voltage source and the positive is connected to the ground now first we will connect the ground place components and go to sources here go down and you will see the ground click on ground and click ok I am placing the ground uh, below and we also need resistors so click on basic now here you can see that resistor click on resistor select any of the resistor and click ok place the place one resistor here and again click ok place the resistor downside for invert now close it and we want a source for source you can take function generator with that function generator we can keep any of the requiring voltage easily here the function generator now here directly the function generator goes to resistance and it goes to negative in that way here plus terminal goes to resistor and resistor goes to negative and the positive goes to ground or I will keep the ground here 
is the ground and common links to the ground where it links to the ground okay next here register feedback resistance is given like this negative to output so here this is the output pin and we have we are connecting to the resistance and from that we are connecting to the negative in that way we are given negative feedback and to observe the output we want to ask close scope how the function click on the ask close scope on the right side and click place here now connect it to the function generator input for one thing and other to the output now connecting negative to the zero ground now connect it here you can see the connection here now we want to give the positive vcc and negative vcc so click on place components and click on sources scroll down to ground down and you will see plus vcc here click on it and click okay keep upside and also select vdd and close it connect vct c to 7th pin and vdd to the 4th pin set the vcc voltage to 12 volts and vdd to minus 12 it is the saturation limit it gives i have set a values now I am setting the resistance values. I am taking R1 value as 2 kilo ohms and R2 as 4 to produce gain. Here you can see the gain formula gain equal to RF by R in RF is 4 and R in is 2. 4 by 2, 2 minus 2 and means minus means negative amplitude. It will reverse down. Now click on the function generator to set the values frequency I am keeping it as 100 and voltage 1 volt sine wave ok click then the simulation uh, the connections are over then uh, click on the oscilloscope you will see this and click run button here you can see that the I am reversing it for a better view here you can see that the original wave and the amplified wave are in reverse direction I am uh, decreasing the volts per division so we have a better wave 1 volt per division it is also 1 volt per division you can see that the both waves I am showing you can see that the oh, this is original signal and this is amplified signal uh, for the color difference I am changing the color click on the wire bean output and uh, go to properties net color and change the color and click ok and apply now run it again here the red color line is the input line and the blue color line is the output line you can see the wave it is amplified double the original as it is gain 2 and minus indicates the opposite direction if it is 1 if the amplitude is 1 it is uh, its uh, amplified wave is 2 and uh, it is negative minus like the way the inverting amplifier works thanks thanks